If it's your intention to implement a hanger door that can be moved like this, then please make sure you include the following words in your hanger door specs. We see so many floor plans like this, which are perfectly designed, but the specifications package doesn't emphasize how the door controls should function. And that leads to doors being delivered that are time consuming and laborious to maneuver. I'm sure that's not what the architects ever envisage. Somewhere on this page, I'm going to provide a written set of specifications for the correct features and components, and you are free to drop them into your bid package. And I must emphasize, not everybody in the hangar door industry is building this door wrong, but there's enough to make me produce this video. So this is a really popular floor plan. It's an eight leaf door system on four tracks. The architect's done a very good job here of trying to explain how he would like the door to maneuver. We want to be able to bypass the door panels in the middle, stack half on the left, half on the right. But I also want to be able to move these all the way down to this end, or I want to be able to move these all the way down to this end. This door is going to move based on the assumption that these specifications highlighted in yellow that I keep talking about have been included. The door operator can stand in the center of the hangar and move these panels all the way to the right. He can then walk back to the center of the door and call call upon these panels to come to him like this then then he can stack and walk those panels down to the other end as one like this very quick very efficient very little walking now i'm going to show you what some door manufacturers send when these specs aren't included we're going to run this back to where we've just finished putting these door panels down at this end Rather than being able to call these panels to him, he actually has to walk all the way down to the end. Then walk the panels this way. Now he has to walk around the door to this operator and start to walk these panels down. Still not done, he has to walk all the way back to this operator and bring these behind. Nobody wants to have to open and close doors this way. It's slow, it's time consuming, and it's laborious. So don't take unnecessary risks and be another victim of cheap and lazy door controllers. The specifications available on this page can be dropped into your bid package. You can even remove Aerodor's name. Just be kind enough to let us know that it's bidding. I also want to point out, it's always a good idea to call us and show us your project so we can determine if any tweaks need to be made. Thank you for watching.